Let all on whom my light falls be welcome if they desire to be so. As the silver moon waxes and wanes, so too does all life. Trust in my radiance, and know that all love alive under my light shall know my blessing. Turn to the moon, and I will be your true guide. The words of Salune, which all novices were charged with. In all honesty, I never had much to do or care for Salune. I once met a cleric of Salune who traveled with us as we hauled cargo between Waterdeep and Baldur's Gate. He wasn't exactly the friendliest person, and I only talked to him briefly. We were transporting some relic or something that he was protecting. Perhaps just a small but heavy statue? We sailors didn't know and just made a guess, since it was in a crate and even the cleric wasn't very forthcoming about what exactly was inside. There was no temple to Salune in Imnus Vale. Most people in the area worshipped Lathander and Shantia. In Athkatla, the capital of Am, Torm, Tyr, Joaquin, and Mylil were dominant, but I do know that there is a temple to Salune there as well. Helm used to be very prevalent in Am and beyond until he was defeated by Tyr in a duel over the love of Timora. Ever since then, even though it was over a century ago, duels have been in fashion when two people vie for the love of another, hence my own 17 years ago. But all this is to say that I just haven't had much to do with Salune and especially her sister Shar, who have been in perpetual war for Toril since its beginning. Though I have heard of Shar and I knew she wasn't good, I never knew much about her until Shudderheart went into the details. Well, I'd be lying if I said I hadn't been dwelling on becoming a Dark Justicia. Perhaps seeing the power of Shah unleashed on that land is keeping the thought in my mind. But don't worry. I still have plenty of room for you in both mind and heart. That's good to hear. I feel like you've been distracted of late. I don't want us to drift apart. I won't pretend that I don't know what you mean. Ever since we entered the Shadow Curse, I felt like something's calling to me. Some purpose that I need to find. Give me some time. If I can figure out whatever it is that I need to do, well, then there should be more time for us. That I am interested in a worshipper of Shar, well, I know my family wouldn't approve. When I think about the situation, even I wonder to myself, what am I doing as well? However, upon seeing and speaking to Shadowheart, though, <laughs> all of that goes away. I think it's in the way she looks and smiles at me. The tone of her voice. The beauty of her face. I find myself completely ignoring what she is and where this little thing we have between us will go. I am a paladin. And I am sworn to do good and fight evil. Yet this woman worships a deity that is evil. We are like fire and water. We couldn't possibly have a future together, could we? I didn't pray to the gods for guidance last year, only to throw it all away to be in love with someone who is unworthy because they worship evil. I also didn't pray to find love, as I had sort of banished it from my thoughts in the last decade of my life. Settling for a single night with a woman I met at a tavern was about the most I had considered I would get to my thirties. I suppose I turned all my... my everything bad within me against myself. I hated Siren. I hated him for a long time. And this all came out after failing that duel so long ago to me now. I suppose I've been running ever since. And I didn't lose a beloved wife and daughter. I was going to begin this journal by lambasting Catheric for turning to Shar, but I myself turned my whole life against itself for the failed love of a woman. So perhaps there is something with losing the love of your life. It can make the most noble among us become the most ignoble. Severe adversity creates either wisdom or madness. I believe I have slowly gained the former, at least I hope. With that clarity, I can say, yes, I do want Shadowheart, but I want her to stop following Shar. That is my condition, and if I cannot dissuade her from it, then I will have to let her go. I am a worthy person, I should have no trouble finding the love that I seek. And I don't need to follow a pretty woman into darkness and search for it. So, what I've been doing has been acting the fool of late. Just hold off your exuberance for now, Siren. We will have to see how Shadowheart fares after we are done here in the Shadowlands. 
She has this whole gauntlet of Shar here in front of us, and either she will continue down the path of Shar or she will break from it. If I support her, I don't know how else she could be even more lost to me. But if I go against her and her goddess, she could drift away from me as well. There is no real way for me to win this other than to pray and hope that she will see sense as well as giving her my friendship and love. Now that that is all out of the way, though, Yes, we found the devil Yurgil, Raphael's nemesis deep inside the gauntlet of Shar, and we defeated him and all his minions. Shadowheart wants to complete the test of Shar to be found in there, as it has ultimate meaning to her faith. But we will wait. We can search through the rest of this level, but I would like to return once everything else has been settled in Moonrise Towers and these Shadowlands. There's way too much going on at the moment. I don't want to get detoured by this huge issue here, for I fear I might lose her to Shar, and all my hopes for us will be dashed. Though she didn't like it, she did agree that the gauntlet of Shar can wait. So we will return to complete it when things in this land are less grim, and she can have all my focus. Right, I've sold what I could. Tried to loosen Breathe up the weight a bit. And move. Lessen the weight. I'm a little curious, I but with us. Thou hast now a bosom companion. Take care that thou art not distracted on thy quest, seeking the comforts of the flesh. What? What are you talking about? You mean Shadowheart? Gods, I... Well, I do wish she were my bosom companion, but... <laughs> it's not, we're not quite there yet. Recall that in time, all becomes dust and bone. No, I'd hate to look at existence like that. Anyways, I did kind of want to speak about Arabella. Fate spins along as it should. Dost thou require a new ally? Or mayhaps a resurrection instead? I guess not. Interesting that he wanted to talk about the Shadowheart and I. Or he brought it up at least. Arabella. If Bowman says I'll be alright, I'll be alright. I just wish. I wish it was different. I wish Mum and Pops was here. Hmm. You've been so strong. They'd be so proud of you. I don't feel so strong. Or anything, really. Just tired. Hmm. You know what? I kind of feel the same. Alright, I think that we can leave this time. We have uh, Lazel and Asterion with us. Fully rested. Should do well. We have this area where we killed uh, everything. I mean, I've looted the bodies, but not searched. Oh. I didn't even you see like this. It here. It's nice. A homie. You are an odd one, Asterion. This is a dedication to my goddess's power and dark beauty. Homie is not the first word that comes to mind. <sighs> Is this... What is this? A bed made of corpses. Disgusting and uncomfortable. Oh my... By the gods, that's awful. I didn't even notice that. I didn't even notice... I thought... I was just thinking maybe... Because we were in such a rush with the devil here. That it was just a bunch of skulls and stuff like that. But no, they're actually... I'm surprised it doesn't smell more foul than it does. But maybe that's a testament to me getting used to this... You, how can you get used to that smell? There are things upstairs. I remember broken pike. There was the rats. There's. <laughs> it's like they're worshiping some kind of lead rat. This 
There's more over here. I'm not sure. Well, let's go upstairs. The we are here is awful. Everywhere in the Shadowlands, but I guess this particular spot is some of the worst. What are these rats doing? Uh, you know what? I could probably find out now that I think of it. Let me speak to these rats. What's happening? Unworthy. Unworthy to walk among friendly bones. Leave! Huh? Calm down. What are you talking about? Talking of you. Intruder. Invader. Unworthy one. These halls are not for you. Oh. Back off, or I'll be scraping my your guts off my heel in a moment. Try it. A lot more guts than you'd expect. A lot more. What about the king? We outnumber you. Leave me be. Uh, I'm not sure what to make of this twisted marrow throne. Maybe Helson could help with this part. Or even Shadowheart, I don't know. You have anything to say, Shadowheart? Well, my day just improved. Other than Did that. Did you want something? Hmm. Nothing to say. They're just rats. They said they have more guts. Maybe we'll be inundated with thousands of rats. I, I don't want that, obviously. I don't even know what to do with them. Twisted marrow throne. But we are intruders. How could rats say such a thing? I think they own this place. It did say there's so many rats in one of the description of how it is down here. These are the only rats I've come across. But that could change if I get belligerent with them. I never expected a rat to talk back to me and tell me to get out of here. <laughs> I had a squirrel do that, and, and a cat. Now a rat. Okay, let's go over here. Large rib cage here. What is this? Through rib cages. What kind of adventure is this? Ugh, the Sierra. Ugh. Intestines. This is so foul, I don't even know where to begin. No more of that. A helmet, long sword, broken shield. Scratch, I kind of need you. Too bad we don't have a cat. We chase those rats away. Maybe if I had a cat. Or oh, maybe if I was changed into a cat through some kind of polymorph uh, spell, they wouldn't have been so cheeky. Ugh. Why must there be piles of bones and everywhere? This is not trapped, is it? Brutes of brilliance? For bards. Oh, it's gold. Let's sell the boots. Oh, I also got these, uh, I bought these back. I think I sold these to, uh, Volo some time ago. Bombs. Light bombs. Maybe we can toss them at a shadow creature. Or whatever they are, just the shadows. And it will be like a... a 
an explosion of light that will harm them. I have a feeling we aren't done with the shadows here. Alright, what is with this giant... I don't know what it is. It looks disgusting. Well-chewed spider carcass oozes on the ground. What is eating it? Uh, I take a... Uh, I study it. Fresh bite marks, an old puncture wound, and a faint pulse of something not entirely natural. Mm. Scan the meat for signs of magical interference. is oozing, but not with blood. It's been dosed with a potion. So what's been eating it? I take a good long sniff. Sulfur, decay, and a thin whiff of something unexpectedly fragrant. Uh. I think I'll leave it at that. I think the devil is eating it. Maybe. One of the devils that were upstairs. The, the, what do you call them? The Maragons or whatever they're called? There's like eight of them or something. Six or eight. We defeated them all. Yeah, we first fought them down in Grimforge. Oh, this is the backside of the same thing. All right. But did, did this go upstairs? Yes, it did. Over here. chest. Some gold and some alchemical ingredients. Ah, oh, we can jump across here. Sell all these things. Broken shield. This is Plaxe. I'm not sure if we've been here. Chambers of penance. Might have been here. Yeah, this is where we fought the devil. Okay. And what's down this way? I'm not sure we can get over here. Maybe we should jump over. Hmm. Lazel, you have that uh, ability to do that, don't you? Get the Yankee jump. Should have been me if you could have done that for me. Looking ahead. 
says there's nothing Very over well. there. A little bit of gold and some disgusting art. Well, I can imagine what the disgusting art is about. Asterion, seriously. Can you go around? We can't really do this with three. Who knows what we're going to encounter, so please keep up. He's coming. Silly elf. We've been here. Well, that looks like a place over there. Let's see if we can't get, go back then. A map, such as I've been recording it. Well, there's areas here, here, and here. It seem to be. I think the... The northern, possibly, or northeast? Northeast is... Been, uh, explored. Hey, all of us, please. Scratch you too! How can I do this without my loyal dog? Alright, so we have the thing for this now. I have no idea what it's going to do, but let's put it in there. The orb? Huh. This is actually weighing me down quite a lot. Let's see if I can't give this to, um... Lazel. Uh, that's much better. Alright, where is that orb right here? A giant glowing marble. Ah, it's brought the platform over here. Wait. Yeah, what's wrong? Nothing. Nothing's wrong at all. W what's going on? Tell me. There's something more I need to do. Or the trials will have been in vain. There is a holy weapon hidden away. The Spear of Night. Spear of Night. I have to claim it. Then use it to make a sacrifice in Lady Shah's inner sanctum. If I succeed, I'll become a dark justicia. Oh, shut her heart. You really want to go through this? A blood sacrifice just to appease Shah? What are you going to sacrifice Lazel? Or me? Certainly not Scratch. Part of yourself? Blood sacrifice tends to mean somebody else. So what's going on? Don't worry. This place has been empty for years. The sacrifice can't be a simple mortal. Oh. More likely it's a monster. And we're well versed in dealing with those, aren't we? We need to get that spear. There's a library in this place somewhere. Library. That's where I need to look. Okay, so... Uh, I take it we don't go this way then? This goes down to where the sacrifice has been made. So we'll leave this for now. Wherever it goes. Where did that skeleton run off to? I think it went this way. What did, what's going on, Scratch? Hanging corpse. A macabre arrangement of flesh. Only a truly depraved mind could dream of such a thing. <sighs> oh, sigil. <laughs> you know, we we don't have to remain here. We can go someplace else. Chair. Another rat. Let's we'll see what the rat has to say. Unworthy of dark cloak. Unworthy of dark fur. Unworthy. That rat's about to bite off more than it can chew. I consider the rat's tone and choice of words. Study the rat's behavior.
the rat holds its ground. It almost seems defiant. Something is wrong. You're just a rat. Is it really wise to stand up to me? We are small, but many. Leave, or see what happens. Unwelcoming vermin aside, we need to explore this place. Leave. Away. My nest. My dark. I have no idea what's going on with this, but you know what? I don't want to run into a whole horde of them. Because eventually, aren't they going to say, you've been here too long, you need to leave, we're going to... We're going to attack. Leave now or we attack. Rat? This is the path of heroes. Your feet sully it. Alright, well, I love animals and raised to respect them. Unless they attack, I'm not going to do anything. But as I said, they may all attack at once. There's a plaque here. I seem to read it. Maybe this one? Brave the gauntlet of Lady Shah. Test body, mind, and spirit with her trials. Glory awaits the few who succeed. Not that we didn't... That's it, isn't it? Reconstructed marksmen. Not that we didn't have livestock and, and put them down or slaughter them when the time came for meat. But we still loved and respected them. I guess to some that may not seem possible, but it is. Just considered it always a natural part of life, death. Head inside! Now! Oh. I'm ready with your turn on dead there, Shadowheart. There's somebody, there's three of them over there. I don't take orders from you, skeleton. Even if you worship Shar or are controlled by Shar or even Catheric. Well, especially Catheric. There's a door here. It's locked. Demanding. McDoddle. Hurry inside, or your racket is liable to. More shadows. Scrotum! The quakes herald the shadows! It's already too late! Ransom dog donkey scrotum. Ugh. This place is not stable. Ugh. I don't think I've ever seen a shadow. These are like Sharon shadows. Miracles. Oh yeah, we had the same thing. It's not supposedly on our side. Destroy these humble tremors. There's four of them though. Well, they've got that one. We've got these two. Swift and lethal. Not exactly. One down. Hmm. Scratch.
Nice. Well, can you also take out this? Spill some blood. That's destroyed too. Oh, we're doing well. I'd say. Just one of these umber tremors left. Oh, more show up. There's more around here. even one back there. There's gonna be a lot showing up in a moment. Still breathing, despite everything. Ah! Um Potion of speed, I suppose. Have to keep going. All right, let's try to destroy this. Ah. Take this! You guys can deal with that one. Alright, there's that one over there. I'm not sure if he can get to it though. They won't know what bit them. Over here. Ha! <laughs> Just one left now. Really sure what you can do, Shadowheart. Make way. Oh, this one here. There's one now in the center. Oh, what in the gods is that thing? Like they have a whole uh, retinue here. You know what? I've got these sponges. Be able to clean me off, make me look more um, presentable. Ugh. That's a potion of speed, really. It'll mess you up. Alright, what is all this? Ghouls now? Some kind of fush golem? Oh. I have no idea who this is.
Keep in mind they could be following the absolute. Not just any true soul would have succeeded in following my path through this place. I you wasn't be pleased. following you. Who are you? You are a true soul. There is no excuse for you to not recognize your betters. Absolute then. Your potential may outweigh your ignorance. I am Balthazar, chief advisor to General Thorne, and entrusted with a mission of utmost importance. Do you know what is at stake here? The name Balthazar seems vaguely familiar, but from where? Recognized by the skull symbol, it's absolute. It comes back to you. Balthazar headed a monastic order that controlled a place called Amkethran in the deserts of Kalimshan. But he is long dead from what you recall. Oh, strange. Balthazar! Wait, it's from Grandmother. I remember that. She said it was one of the children of Baal. If I remember right, I heard of a monk by that name once. He died long ago. Oh, him. Yes, I decided to take his name for myself. Oh, so you are After him. taking his rib bones. Suits me but. better, I think. But enough idle chatter. Keep to the matter at hand. You do know what's at stake here. Yes. If I remember right, it was one of the few actual good children of Baal, but they still had to battle with my grandmother in the end. Uh, judging by how you're cowering here, in here, your survival. I do not cower. I plan. I command. I create. General Form trusts me. He knows I will deliver. He knows I will stand by him long after all others wilt and fall. You and all the rest have only one body with which to serve. I have as many as I care to make. It's making me wonder about if he has something to do with the so-called immortality of uh, Catheric. As you mentioned serving Catheric, he sent you to find a relic, no? General form to you, but yes. Recovering the relic is the crux of it. He commands, and I, his humble servant, fulfill that command. Whilst well, destroy them, and these people. And more humble servant, fulfill my command. I will put you to work as a scout. This necromancer has Catherick's trust. Helping him could be just what you need to gain access to the man himself. I need more to go on. Why is this relic so important? What does it do? Fine, if it'll spare me your bleating. The relic lends the general his strength, his ah, invulnerability. There we go. It must be recovered before his enemies attempt to exploit it. This one's so stupid he doesn't realize that time here to be Catheric's doom. So you need my help? I do not need you or your help. But you are here in spite of that, so I may as well make use of you. The relic is close, but the way is barred and Shah's dead are uncooperative. Clear the path for me by blade, cunning, or whatever it takes. I will remain here until you have succeeded. Or fallen. I trust this gas bag about as far as I can throw him, which isn't far. 
but perhaps better to play along for now. That's what I was thinking, unfortunately. I'm just so tempted to cleave his disgusting undead head off. Okay, so wait, uh... You have resources... If I can get him to spare some of his soldiers, or whatever, power, it, may, it might make it easier to bring him down afterwards. You have resources to spare? Give me something to aid my search. To aid you on your way. Ring this bell, and he will come. Who's this one? My brother is no intellectual powerhouse, but he is strong, loyal, and punctual. Should a fight turn against you, remember the bell. Hmm. What exactly are we going up against? After defeating the devil, I rather thought everything else in here would be simple. I suppose not. That thing is really disgusting, by the way. So are you. Mm. I take the bell. Flesh will remain here until called. But don't fear. He has very sharp hearing. I chose his ears myself. Now, get to work. And I don't want to see any white marks on it. Well, wait. Not lost your nerve, I hope. I tend to remove those from my creations. Too much fuss. Oh. Where's that bloody embalming fluid? <sighs> Thirsty. Uh. Nasty. Um, we acquired an umbral gem from the lair of the Orthon. Enter the temple's inner sanctum. We must complete the gauntlet of Shah. Right. Trials made for her. Yeah, he said Sharon. I would think that the the devil, the Sutton Orthon, would be difficult. But maybe the trials would be difficult too. It's a broken moon lantern over there. Dead pixie. Don't dare steal anything. Bring me a And I don't want to see any white marks on it. Let's go. Enough! My creations have nothing to say to you. Interesting. Just tiss your avenger. Good here. I hope. Incense. Nothing but incense on. What's this? Silver chalice. Room for more. Ith bank. More incense. More incense. Vaz. I've always said Vaz, not Vaz. Oh, okay, so... I thought the door that opened was this one, but apparently not. As we came from that way, and the first thing I really saw were the, these doors on either side. Thing to say. Let's see if we can't open this. With a flick of the wrist. Ooh, this is a difficult lock. Don't know if I can do it. Apparently I can.
This is the way back out. Oh, right. That's what I wanted to do. I wanted to go... I should have gone there from camp. Treasure room. Uh, back to Last Light Inn to wake up Art Kala. Plaque. Feed your bodies and rest your minds. Lady Shah needs her warriors strong and ready. Oh, look at all these things. White mushroom. Alchemical ingredients, right? Mushroom soup. Let's just take everything. Yeah. Plates we can... S silver that we can sell and... The food... Uh, the, it's not really food, but... Well, mushroom soup might be. Alright, so who's Traps, preparing the table? There's more over here. Things from the surface is what they are. Or when it was nicer. These mushrooms. Enormous. My mistake, I didn't use guidance. That's where they got all the mushrooms from. Well, you don't need sunlight for mushrooms, so... Yeah, now that I think of it, everything was a mushroom type of mushroom. What we got? I don't even know what that is. Uh... Scratch. I thought there'd be something in here we'd have to fight. It just smelled it coming. Right. So what are you? Is this some kind of bat? Aberration. Well, I hope these aren't some kind of... S see, that you can see through them, though. I think we need to get up to this thing and kill it. Truth be told. I need to jump. If it's an aberration, I don't really know. Okay, take this. That hurt it. A lot. How about fire now? Um, slash... Oh, 
Oh, I hurt it well. Let's spill some blood. Kind of surrounded, not really in a good position. Hmm. Hmm. It's right. Oh, he's, he can't move. Well, that doesn't help. So, can't do anything. So let's take one of these potions, which we have a lot of. You've been frightened. You're going to be unable to move, too. What are some of your spells? Protection spell, at least. Not getting away from me so easily. Are you frightened too? You know, I could really use some help here. I guess it's not that big deal, I've got it. She won't be able to move, but you know what? She can do this. Everybody is now blessed and healed a bit. I'm going to still focus on this thing. Um. That! Oh, it's not quite dead. Very close, though. Give me a little bit of help here, please. Can you? Target's too far. Are you frightened? He's frightened. It's got Hunter's Mark on it. Still frightened. <laughs> ah, too bad you can't jump. You can't miss your step either. Oh wait, yes you can. If you could do this, and go like this. That will do it. One's down. Still bleeding, are you? She's not frightened. Ah. Time to meet your maker. Mute to poison.
Ah, they were just creations from it. This was the only real creature here. And it had nothing on it to loot. All that effort and nothing. Another step forward. Hmm. Let's hope these aren't like the mushrooms in the Underdark, the ones that kept disappearing. I wonder who did that. Was that Auntie Ethel? Because it was right out of where I consider her an entrance to her place to be. Mushroom hopping. Will too. Dragon Age mu Dragon Egg Mushroom. Alright, let's see what's up here. Is there a way through there? Where does that go exactly? This way. Okay, just hold on. Well, there doesn't seem to be anything this way. Alright, well. so let's see what's over here. Where have we found ourselves, huh? Sarcophagus? Ring? Plaque. What does it read? In darkness, beauty is equal and wealth unseen. I suppose that's true. Everybody is equally beautiful and equally... No, well, everyone's equally beautiful in the dark. Maybe that's what Shah is all about. Maybe she's really hideous. She wants darkness because she's just so ugly. I don't know. Bring over here, let's go down then. I'm sure this comes out to one of the halls that we were in before. I think so. The elevator should be to the right. Step carefully. There's a trap. Ah yes, this spot. Traps are Asterian speciality. <gasps> Guess we didn't. There's another trap. Forward. We didn't explore this area completely before. Be careful. There are traps about. Oh, I'm practically stand. I am standing on it. I'm surprised that uh, Shadowheart isn't saying anything about defiling this place by looting everything. What does this open up? And what does this do? Did I pick something up? I turned it off. I know not what that means, actually. Trap. Just that there's one on the other side here, so. Chucked more traps. I... Alright. What now? Toadstool. Tomb cover. Necklace. Yeah, I'd... we're kind of plundering the With place. Haste. She doesn't seem. 
Shadowheart doesn't seem to care, so... I mean, that's fine with me. Honestly, I have no idea what these levers are... Like, I know it's bringing this down, but what is this doing? Alright. I can restart it. I have no idea what's even going on with that. Alright, so there's another area to the other side. There's also the other double door that was locked. If we go this way, there are traps about. Where? Oh. Watch your back. Disable that, please. Over there. I thought this is the way we went. Pretty sure. Seems to have ended. Maybe we went this way and then made a left. Oh no. I think we made a right, went up there, and then came back and went straight down this way. I'm not sure. It might have had a dead end. Probably did. Isn't this the platform? Time to press ahead. Yeah, Shadowheart said not to take it till we go to the library. Her exact words were. Um. In order to become a Dark Justicia, not exact words, but this is what I wrote down. She must first acquire a weapon called the Spear of Night, hidden somewhere in the Silent Library. I have no idea where that is. If that's even down here. We may have to leave pre prematurely. Whoa, 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 there's traps all over the place. Best to disable them. Or not. To try disabling that, Keep your distance, please. Now. At least it didn't go off and explode. There. At least things have stayed in. You know, you don't get. Well, sometimes I guess you do get second chances with traps like that one, What's but sometimes you don't. Like that room in the Mason's or the hallway in the Mason's Guild, as we were going to it, where the gates came down, the wall opened up, and then there was uh, a bunch of those gargoyle heads that shoot fire at you. It didn't go off. Well, we had a limited chance to um, disable them, a little bit of time. And chance. If we failed, we How much it would go off. Go? So I'm pretty sure this is where we came in. And there's a barrier that threw me way back. Scared the gods out of me. What's down this way? Did we go this way? No, we have not been this way. A silent library around here. It's a plaque. So, but, but this is the other thing, um, where we are, let's see, if I can find it, find the Night Song. So, Cutheric Thorm has sent his trust and servant Balthazar to Thorm Mausoleum to retrieve the Night Song, and that's who we just spoke to, that disgusting man, who took his ribs from the real Balthazar? Uh, I don't even know what to think about that. Maybe it's hyperbole. We found an abandoned Temple of Sha underneath the Thorn Mausoleum. The Night Song must be within. So, another reason to be here, a Night Song. Whatever that is, it seems Catheric wants it too. We can't allow him to have it. And perhaps it would really impress Shadowheart, since I seem to be going all in in that direction. The rain of night comes in a thousand falling leaves. Hmm. I can sell this scroll of dark vision, which is completely useless because every one of us, including Gale, can see in the dark. He has that ring. Give him dark vision. I suppose if we ever come across something that uh, 
It takes our ability to see in the dark. Or sucks the ring off Gale's fingers. <laughs> then, then we'll have use for uh, scrolls of dark vision. But until then, it's absolutely completely useless. It's like carrying a scroll of create water when we're walking past a river or a stream. It's just absolutely unnecessary. Okay, so I think Let's that we should continue does. to go back. Go to those other doors back here. Jump. Oh. Now they gotta get a f closer mm. to jump. Alright. Jump again. You two scratch. I like it when my dog jumps. Part of a team. No. Oh, yeah, yeah. Jump over here. <laughs> Yeah, let's go back to those doors. Alright, we're back to where that eating area was. There's more rats. Curious. We didn't go in here, I don't think. No, this is a journal. We definitely have not been here. The handwriting is a hasty, lopsided scrawl about the pages are blots of ink and what may be smudges of dried blood. Lady Shark continues to preserve me, though escape is impossible. The beast still prowls our halls. Though the sounds of battle no longer reach my ears, I fear all my brothers and sisters have fallen in defense of the Night Singer's sacred gauntlet. But I shall wait. The beast will not linger for long, surely. A shorter entry, the handwriting even more skewed and erratic. The beast still remains. Why does it not just leave? And why does it sing? The food is gone, I must preserve my strength. The final entry is barely legible. It sings. Night Singer? Mistress, embrace me, please. They gave up. But they did leave a key. Just to see our helmet. Chest here. Gold ingot. Take all these. I can still speak with animals. See what these rats have to say. You know, if maybe if we pass this gauntlet, the rats, or if, at least if Shadowheart does, the rats will be friendlier? We'll have to find out. So, I see five rats are surrounding some... an altar to Shar. Two legs, too familiar. Okay. What's up for discussion? Join an army, became an army. Leave! A place of offering to the Dark Lady. May she embrace the entire world. The face looks odd here. Different from what I remember. I don't know. Uh, am I really going to do this? I guess I can ask a prayer of the Dark Lady. Yeah, I would ask prayers for so many other gods. Pray at the altar. Not sure if I know how to make a proper prayer. Try that again. Pleasurable shiver runs down your spine. You feel as if you've unburdened a troubling thought and forgotten it forever. Seem to have gained her favor. Huh? Hey, rats. Unworthy. Unworthy to walk among friendly bones. Leave! If I'm unworthy, how come I just got Shah's favor? Animals can be very stubborn, I suppose. 
She has an odd face. Is that normal? Have I, have I not been seeing her with just masks on? Maybe that's what her face is supposed to look like. Really strange looking. Definitely not a human type. Demi-human either. Right, so there was another door here, is it not? Did just sister that we killed Anything Night please. Weaver. I would like to go to the Lin uh, the um that inn, return to the last light inn. Open please. With pleasure. Maybe after this, if there's nothing we can find in here. Nice try. He says this is one of the most difficult locks he's ever tried to pick. Okay, then try again. Hmm. He says he almost had it. Where? Well, try again. If anyone can open this, it would be you. if we couldn't find a key for it somewhere. Ah, he says he almost had it again. Well, we can keep trying. He's not breaking the, the picks, so... Or I probably would have broken them. Let's keep trying. Now he's cursing. Come on, Asteran, you can open this up. Oh, he says he almost had it again. can just keep on trying, I suppose. Finally, he says he thinks he's got it. Alright, there better not be a dragon behind here. Just not ready for that. As it could have. Should mind my step. Twentieth time's the charm, it seems. Chess? I would... Whoa. Okay. We can open it again. It scared me for a moment. I thought we might have been locked in here. Anybody see anything tra like a trap? Callous glow ring. Increases damage against creatures that are illuminated. I mean, like, in the light. Oh, more inferno iron. Another reason I'd like to go back. Oh, these are great for... I'd love to... To grab up all these. These are great for Gale. A book. Teachings of Loss. Endless Dark. Breathe in and out. Look inward. What in the deepest reaches of yourself do you see? A bright and blinding light. A harsh, exacting sun. Or instead, do you find a comforting velvet darkness? A womb-like place where all you are, exactly as you are, can find repose? This is the darkness Shara promises, a darkness free from judgment, free from scrutiny, in which we are invited to exist in our purest essence, our most essential selves. No, I think inside, a peaceful place for me would be like a warm, warm garden, lots of green, bright sunlight, nice warm day. Not too hot, some of those summers in Arm can be way too hot. Enough to turn a Asterion red. He probably would. Actually, he wouldn't be able to be out there. 
Well, maybe now he can with the uh, tadpole, but enough to turn a pale elf. I don't know, a tanned one? Or just burn them up, I suppose. Something good here. There's a chest I over hope. here. All right, so we, I guess it's like summoning the ogres who never came, by the way. And hopefully this one will come. I'm not sure if there's anything else left here, and we certainly haven't found any silent library. Oh, found the treasure room. I think that that's it, unless we want to go down that thing. We don't. Right. So that being the case, let's go to the last light and see if we can't... Oh, sometimes teleporting is a little disorientating. Let's go see if Damon can't make... I've got... Uh, we've got two Inferno Iron, I think... I think I gave one to, to Karlak. Well, let's see if we can't do something with this one. If you can, then we'll have to get the other one. So I might as well hammer. Need anything? Oh. Maybe Karlak needs to be here? I don't know. Let's see what you have. I've got a lot of things to sell anyways, so... He's got a lot of gold. Half of it's from me. Alright, let's uh, sell what we can. I've sold a bunch of things. Got the stuff that I wanted. Although... This incandescent staff will send to uh, camp. Oh, this is Lazel's color. Blue dye is mine. Solemn Gollum. We'll hold on to that. <laughs> Solemn, summon him here. Even if he would come, that would be very bad. Oh, well, maybe not. Everybody around here would be able to kill it. Help me kill it. Let's see. We have the means to wake up our color. Halson. No more. We need to rouse him. I found a loot. It seems to have belonged to the Flaming Fist. Good. Its music might help restore him. Show it to him. I pull out the loot I found and play a little. Little experience with loot. He's still trapped oh. there. He needs help. Hmm? Calm. Breathe. <laughs> well. You've been trapped in the shadow fell for a century. Take a moment to clear your mind. Poor a man. Century. You're Halsin. He knows. Daniel said to find you. You must help him. Please. I will. But I need to know where Thaniel is. If I venture into the Shadowfell blind, I will never find him. I'm not sure I can put it into words. The landscape there shifts and changes. No, I haven't seen a place like that. Was there anything that could offer guidance? Something that didn't change? Lavender. Hmm? Whenever I saw Thaniel, I always smelled... Lavender. I can work with that. Lavender. Rest now. Meet me by the lake shore. I have what we need to proceed, but I'll need your help. Be ready. This may prove perilous. I think I've been all over the Shadowlands. I haven't seen anything that constantly changes. I haven't been in Moonrise Towers. I'll say a prayer to Timora for your good luck. A copper to the lady returns tenfold in gold. So they say. Maybe something that will help you and Halston too. Art. Thaniel will be so scared there alone. We looked after each other for such a long time. I hope 
hope he's all right. So when you were unconscious, you were with him. I take it. Oh, right. We need to get going. Yeah, keep sight narrows it. Let's go. Meet him by the lake, he said. Oh, I see him. Oh, that's one of the first areas I went to. Do we got into here? I hope we were able to find him in a place that shifts constantly. Where has his mind been? Helson? You're here. Good. Now we can begin. First, I want to know what to expect. Thaniel is trapped in the Shadowfell. But thanks to your efforts, I know where to look. Now I must go there. Alone. Uh... Hold on, shouldn't I come with you? No. This opportunity has been a hundred years in the making. It has to be me. And only me. But I All didn't right. bring you here to witness an old druid's grandstanding. We to protect you? You have a part to play in this. And I trust you will play it well. With the Oak Father's blessing, I can infiltrate the Shadowfell, but doing so will sap my strength. Oh. I'll need your help if I'm to return. I need you to stay here, keep the portal open until I return, and defend it at all costs. Okay. Upon my oath, Druid, I swear you shall be safe. Good. Now it's important that only I pass through the portal once it opens. The magic is fragile. Any mistake, and our one chance will be lost forever. All right, only you go. I get it. It took me years of study. Of seeking the Oak Father's favor. To find a way to part the veil. Pray that this works. Lathander, please help us in our oh, endeavor Father. here to cure these lambs Hear of the me. shadow. Aid me. Force open the jaws of darkness. Make passage for your vessel of light. It's ready. I'll return with Thaniel as soon as possible. Stay close to the portal. Buy me what time you can. Notice this wasn't within the bounds of the last light in, so we could be attacked. Everybody get ready. Shadow cursed harpers. Ah, oh, I think we're being attacked by everything the Shadowlands has. Seems like a bit of everything. Shadows, wraiths, shadow curse, harpers, and even dogs. Why did it have to be the dogs? Poor dogs. Um, well, we can certainly use a blessing. Careful against those wraiths, Lazo. Oh, she's going to charge off and go attack. Maybe we should wait for them all to come to us. They are undead, right? Okay. They're undead. Which means... That we can use our undead killing powers against them. Try not to miss. I think they'll go right over fire, these shadows. It's useless against them. Oh, yes, they can do that. Who's that wraith?
Hmm. I'll do it my way. Let's go. A little hard not to be spotted, especially with so much light coming through here. I don't know if you're going to be able to do anything from up there. Uh, hiding wise at least, anyways. But you can use everything you have. Um, You don't, too bad you don't have an arrow of light, just lightning. Nothing important is ever easy. Let's do this properly. I may not be able to sweep around like uh, lays out cam with a two handed weapon, but see, this also, I guess I've already cast my spell Moonbeam. I'm not sure if that will really help. But you know what? There's something else that we have that could very much help us. I always seem to forget to it. Every time I look for it, right? Nope. Ah, let me look. Haste spore grenade. Ah. I don't think it... I can get us, but... I, I want to get down there. There. Unfortunately, it won't be getting our vampire. Sing, filler love, sing. Canto Got it. Good job, Scratch. I don't want this thing to come near us. They tend to use... yes. That's not good. There's a lot of them. Oh, I wish we had Gale for a fireball or something. May not have Gale. But we can get a lot of them with this. Whoa! Well, that worked out well. <laughs> Better than I thought. Okay, and. Nice blessing. More foes. Helsin better get back soon. More are coming. If I only had like a staff of infinite fireballs. Alright, um this is you. Birds too? Ravens. What is this, a vine? Like I said it it's throwing everything it has at us. I'm not sure. I don't... Uh, try, let's just kill this thing for now. No. Oh, you have to be within the spores. I thought it would have been something that lasts for a while, but no, you have to remain within the spores for it to work. Okay. Right. Guess we make our stand right up here then.
Right. Um, Air of lightning. If we could get a bunch of them at the same time. Is there any tough enemy here? I don't think that there is. Well, some of these harpers could be tough. Down here. Hey, spores, now. Infect me. But we can't leave. Wish that I had something to throw. Oh, uh... I do. One of these. We'll try this light bomb next time. Ah, they're trying to hit the portal. I didn't know that. I thought they were trying to hit you, Asterion, when you were over there. Alright, uh... That's not good if they're shooting at the portal like that. We need to stop them. I'm not close enough. So this thing will attack you if you... Le uh, it's not a big deal. If you can get over there... Let's do it. Well, that sounded absolutely terrible. There's more Harpers coming. I suppose you could try to go get them all again with your turn on dead. Oh well, that's a lot of them. Oh, everything's... It's, they're not even... Some must have fallen to the curse. Get wires. This just got tougher. <sighs> we need to kill everything, including these vines that get through. You're not in the spores. There. Alright. Uh, not sure what you can do. This has limited range. No choice but Could I toss you this? If you can cast this laser. It would really help right now. Oh, there's even more. Get that group. Well, it didn't destroy them, but it hurt them. 
I don't know how long these haste spores will be here for, but we can't leave this platform. Anything that gets past us is going to attack. Get into the spores. That's what you need to do. What can you do here? Ice knife. Ah. Doesn't do as much damage as it used to. When we were of lower level. How about something... Arrow of Ice? Well, that, they're already going to be slowed down. Got two. More Arrows of Ice? Oh, you're really sticking it to them, aren't you? Hmm. Could cast this upon. Er I learned this from Arabella. Already ice there. There's ice there too. They're trapped. Make sure that nothing's coming from this side. There is. Two shadow. There's a shadow and a wraith over there. Take this, Wraith. Got got it. Shadow. I won't let them get by. Scratch, I'm not sure what you're going to do from up here. Go and bite those little pilgrims down there, I suppose. Don't go into the vines. you come from? I wish you had the ability to use Sunbeam again. Hmm. Well, you can turn undead. If you... This would be a good spot. Right. I don't like to hear the screams of people suffering, but... And the turn, they're running, too. Makes it easier for us. Make sure nobody gets up to the shadow crossing. Look at them run. Oh, we've got new ones coming in. Get the Yankee. Get the Yankee. Sense him. Needs a little more time. Alright, um. Hard to see you exactly with your that blur spell you have cast around you. Very nice. Um. 
<laughs> what would I do without you, Lazo? Taking position. Can you feel death's cold grip? Got a dog right here. You still have the 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 hurt. Uh Curse that one. <laughs> Got it. It's dead. Oh, well, I didn't mean to get you, Lazo. Can't even catch my breath. I'm a little concerned about these things, though. They are turned, but not forever. Um. Hmm. We can deal with this one. We seem to have them over there. Okay, they're running, or Lazo has them. Sure, what to do? Wrathful smite, thunder smite. Maybe if I jump down there. Oh, they don't like the shriek. Wish I had an undead killing smite. Oh, wait. I believe that's what Divine Smite is meant for, but yeah, Fiends and Undead. But something that really, really hurt them, like a turn undead. Alright, so let's hit it as hard as we can. It's still standing. Not any more. Alright, you're not going anywhere. Oh, it's really aiming. So you're gonna have to pass Lazel too. <laughs> oh, where to go? Make sure it's not up here. It's not. I've got that shadow. You guys can deal with the rest of these. Uh, Alright, this shadow in front of me has disappeared. I suggest you get up there. The spores are now gone. And, uh, shoot whatever you can. It's too far away. Where do I go from here? Yeah, I don't know where it went. At the ready. Where did you go, Shadow? Need to act fast. Uh, coming back now.
Is this three of them? Here it is. There it is. Ah! Oy. He's gone again. Is he back? It's done. I have him. You found him. You said a little fay boy. But something's wrong. Dreadfully wrong. What's wrong? No. He's not dead, is she? Can't be. Is he dead? No. But some part of him is missing. He's. Is he like Art Color was? Hollow. I need to examine him back at the camp. Come see us when you can. <sighs> I feel I rather inspired from that. And well, in it. Uh, I need to rest. The sunset can't come quickly enough. Sunset? You want to get that here? Or, or sunrise? Uh, Helsen rescued Thaniel from the Shadowfell, but the spirit of the land is ill. If we want to help, we need to speak to... Th we need, maybe now that we have the boy, like it was with Art Color, we need to find a means to wake him up. But he said he's hollow. That doesn't sound right. Art Color was murmuring and sweating and... Let's he was definitely look. alive. That boy, to me, seemed dead. A lot of loot to be had from all these. Encumbered now. Alright, well, we'll loot everything up and then we'll go meet Helson. Did find this task at hand on one of the dead. Was it Harper's? I need the Shadow Mastiff alive and intact. If that is not the case, the second half of your payment shall be forfeit upon your return to Baldur's Gate. I have generously paid a large amount of gold in advance, and have supplied all the necessaries you shall require to see this endeavor done correctly. They say you are unmatched as a poacher. For your sake, I hope that is no exaggeration. Shadow Mastiff. Well, that's one animal I wouldn't mind hunting. Let's keep searching. A faded memory of a boy and girl sharing their first kiss. Your own heart almost flutters in tune with theirs. How sad. Several shadow vestiges. You can almost feel the heat from the forge. This one was once a blacksmith. Desperate prayers to Saluna echoing from the past. They did not save him. You sense a fading echo of the person who once was, a dock hand. He did not ask for this. No one does. He the young Harper on the eve of battle against Thorn long ago. He and his comrades toast each other in last light. Hmm. Thoughts of baby names. She did not wish for her firstborn to be named after her mother-in-law. Muldred. Ugh. <laughs> right, let's go sell and return to Helsinki camp. to go find Helsin. I was inspired by that fight laser. I was inspired. Where's the boy being kept? Well, maybe in the, the inn. Thaniel is resting. But it's no easy slumber. I discovered what's wrong with him. The shadows rendered him in two when they bore him away to the shadow fell. In two? Half of his essence remained here, amidst the curse. What stayed behind would have been the strongest part of him. But after all these years left in the darkness, corruption must have taken hold. Hmm. How do you know this? I knew something was wrong when he didn't wake up. But now I'm even more certain. 
By now we should have seen some small glimmer of Thaniel's power. A sign that the land is healing. New growth, flowers in bloom. But there has been nothing. You haven't gotten the greater part of them back. Can it be undone? Perhaps. If we can find Thaniel's lost half and make him whole again. Only the missing half may not come willingly. The curse will have sunk its tendrils deep, twisting Thaniel's essence into something else. Hmm. I met sort of a shadow child before, a little boy named Oliver, around Thaniel's age. And you saw this boy yourself? Yes. That can't be a coincidence, but we need to be sure. And I truly mean we, if you wish. Every moment counts, and I've asked much of you already without being at your side. <laughs> so you're going to come? Uh, I'll see what I... Well, maybe not. All right, leave it to me. This doesn't have to be your burden alone. Every moment counts, and I've asked much of you already without being at your side. If you want me, I'm yours. Oh, I thought that's against what you were getting curse, at. Against the absolute... Anything. Just say the word. Well, you know, if we do lift the curse, I guess you've got nothing to tag along with us for other than fighting the absolute. So, join me. An unwieldy number. You must cut someone loose before I can join you. Hmm... I don't know how good of a fighter you'll be, but... Uh... You could take Asterion's place. He'll stay here. I'm with you. Wow. You're going to actually be in my party? I did get you a few things, but, uh... Yeah, let's see what we can do, and then... Let's go to the inn and see how uh, Thaniel is doing. And then after that we'll go find Oliver, I suppose. At least we're heading in the right direction. <laughs>